Hi everyone, hope you are doing fantastic today. In this video, we're going to work with the Foxit Phantom PDF application essentially to modify a scanned document. So say you're given a document, you scan it in through your multifunction and you want to be able to change the text in it. That's what this video is gonna show or demonstrate. So as you can see here on screen, have File Explorer open, I'm inside the Scans folder, and I've scanned in three documents that were converted from a paper document, hard copy, into PDF digital format. And I did rename them to line up with the document that they are. So, directly behind that, this is the Foxit Phantom PDF application. I am looking at the protocol PDF that was scanned earlier and you can see here that it's a document that simply has text and bullet points. So what I'm wanting to do, I'm just wanting to change a couple uh, a couple words to this. You know, something fairly simple. Now whenever you open up your Fox at Phantom PDF app, you'll probably be here at the home tab and you'll see some of these items here in the ribbon some of the tasks and functions that you can perform now in my case I want to go ahead and I'm going to click on the convert tab so that is what you'll want to do as well however if you want to run a quick OCR you could go ahead and do this but it might not perform the exact same or the exact option that you're wanting it to do so I'm going to click on the convert tab and over to the right I'm going to go to the OCR button because I'm wanting to convert the text. But first, I'm going to click on the OCR button, then I'm going to click on current file. Now what this is going to allow is allow for the OCR engine to operate. Give you the option to either select current page, which would be page one that you're currently on. Um, or you could of course do a range of them so maybe if you're working on a 700 page document you could quickly run the OCR on maybe 10 pages out of the 700 in our case since this is only two pages we'll just leave all pages there you can see here the settings are going to apply to the English language and it's gonna what we are wanting is to make it editable now you can uh, make searchable text which that may be what your application is currently set on so just want to if you want to edit it you just want to make sure that the editable text button is selected but go ahead and say okay we'll let this process you can see here that it has ran through now we're going to go back up to the home tab click on that and what we're going to want to do is run the edit object and we run this because whenever you scan a document in as a PDF it's going to be an image and in order to make the text editable we'll need to edit the object so I'm gonna go ahead and select the edit object button and we're gonna choose text for this now you can see that when I take the cursor, each little text or word will have a box outlining it. And each one individually has that option applied to it. So I'm going to double click in here. And I'm just going to simply change the word room to area. And I will use the delete key on the keyboard to remove any additional text. And you can see here the period. If I click on it, I can simply move that. And I'm going to move it just a little over to the left to make it a little more congruent with the remaining line of text here. And there we have it. So that allowed me to scan a paper document through the scanner, go to my computer, open up the Fox Phantom PDF application and I was able to modify the text that's on here. Well, I hope that helps. Thank you very much. Have a great day.